Konnichiwa Devius, no Classic Gamer here and welcome to another part of Let's Play Raymon on the Sega Saturn. In the last part we completed Pencil Pentathlon and now we're moving on Space Mom's Crater. No! Oh my god, this is gonna be tough. Alright, I gotta be careful not to die and do my best. As for the beginning, I have to say one thing. We're not gonna be getting the extra lives or doing anything uh, risky. Why? Because I really don't want to waste uh, time making this longer than it could be. And plus, I might end up losing uh, life instead of gaining one, since it can be difficult. Uh, if you're not trying to get um, the extra lives and stuff like that, I would say the first phase is light medium. Ouch. Okay, gotta be careful. I'm not at a good timing, so I need to let go, and then, then swing again, and yeah, I did. I'm not gonna go down, I'm just gonna go straight forward where I'm supposed to go to get into, get the cage, and yeah, finish the first phase. Um, it's light medium, like I said. Now we have to be careful for the anti-tunes. Ouch. That's better. Crawl under, and... This should be a last one. Yep. Oh, no, 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 come on. Yes. Uh, now this part... You need to just use a propeller... Uh, right about... When you're dropping, just use it when you're near the uh, pink ring. So, yeah. And... We did it. One more. And checkpoint. Let me get a good uh, run. Okay, this isn't tough. You don't need any. You can do this without uh, speeding up, and it's less risky, at least in my opinion. Now, up there is the cage, okay? We need to go up on the ma maximum we can and. Uh, Make sure not to fall down here. Swing here, and yes, this part is tough, because if you if you fall down like I just did, you're gonna see, okay, uh, we're gonna we need to make sure not to repeat the same mistake again. Uh, we need to uh, be careful since these things up there uh, regenerate the spiky balls. Yes, and come on. Jump and Yahoo! The first cage. Now the second one is really easy. Just drop down. Uh, not go down here. Make sure this ring appears. And just continue swinging, and you're gonna see a second cage and the exit. So yeah, we're gonna be doing that. Okay, let me get a good run. Jump over the exit. And destroy the cage first. Get the uh, things, and yeah, we did the first phase. As I said, it was a light medium, in my opinion, at least. If you're not trying to get the extra, there is one other. There is another exit on this level, uh, located somewhere else. But honestly, I don't want to go there. Uh, anyways, let's get a power. We've been lacking on health lately. Okay, make sure, jump over that. And also, here we're gonna have, a, I believe, a two cages as well. Yep. Uh, this has uh, like um, three phases, and on each phase you can get two cages. Um, three times two equals uh, six, so yeah, we're gonna get all the cages. But first we need to make sure to go up here. This is the right way, and here is a checkpoint. Now, this part is gonna be a little hard. Just make sure to land on... What? I fell through this? Okay. Let me just get rid of the anti-tune. That's better. Okay, now we need to make a better jump. That's more like, and we already see the the cage, but that's not the first one we're gonna get. We're gonna get, no wait, it's not down there, it's here. 
Oh yes, this one is really easy. You just make sure to... Ouch. Didn't dodge the anti tune but never mind, we have more health. And here is another power, so that's great. Let's kill uh, hunters. And yep, here is the cage. Easy. As for this phase in general, I would say it's generally easy, okay? It's not it's not hard at all. You just uh, need to know what you are doing and uh, it's not a big deal. There is one a bit tricky part, but still it's not. Come on. Compared to uh, what we're gonna see after this phase, like phase 3, the hardest one, the hardest part in the entire game, uh, you're gonna you're gonna see what I'm talking about. But first, let's go here, get a small power, and now get a good run and jump. Ouch. Uh, this is the way for the last cage on this phase, okay? And uh, we we'll just need to knock the these spiky balls out of the way so we can jump over and get get to the cage, okay? And we're Okay, can do it again. Oh, the anti tunes. Good thing I didn't crawl under those spiky balls, because then the anti tunes would get me. Uh, more of them. And here is the cage. We did it. Now let's see. Let's just. Uh, okay, we can we can jump over that. No, I'm angry at him. I'm not gonna let him live. Okay, nothing here. Let's get good. What? I swear I pressed a uh, gem. Well, are those uh, uh, electons sleeping like on those spikes or something? Wow. They're actually uh, stronger than Raymond when it comes to obstacles, they can be hurt. And apparently, not even anti tunes can hurt them. They, they can. Uh, Electons like can only be captured apparently in cages. Yeah, they can't be killed. I I, I realized why why they were captured in cages and not killed because they can't die. They can't die. Okay, even when uh, Raymond dies, he turns into bunch uh, uh, Electons, which proves that uh, uh, Electons can die really. When Raymond dies, he turns into a bunch of Electons, and the Electons are alive. So yeah, well. That's pretty much what I think about Electoons. I think they're like uh, immortal. And that was a proof. The spikes. Okay, and jokes aside, that's just uh, how it was programmed. Okay. Oh, the phase three. Oh my god. Anyways, the background. We see it's different than the PlayStation version. We can clearly tell that. Okay, let me get it. Oh, what? I I was there for a second, but I guess I pressed the button. Silly me. Okay, come on. Ugh, still bad timing. Okay, when it's at the top, I need to jump. Okay, we did it. Now, drop down. This is the hardest spot part in the game, in the entire game. There is. If you beat this, uh, then the rest of the game is not going to be that hard like this part this phase in general ouch so yeah after this all the parts are gonna be much easier anyways let me get the power and yeah we did oh the checkpoint by the way in the PlayStation version there was a checkpoint before that part with the power I don't know why was it cut from uh, Saturn version but I guess I don't remember was the checkpoint here in the PlayStation version I honestly don't remember but I know it was uh, before. Anyways, we're now jumping here to get to the cage. That's why we need to we needed to go a little bit on that platform, on the moving one, and then go a bit back, and then bunch of these stuff is gonna appear. So we need to now go up, activate the cage with the things. Okay, it appeared. So let's destroy it. Just. Sure. Ouch! Okay, let's go here. That's much better. Ouch! Never mind. Uh, the la we got uh, almost all cages. We we're just missing the last one. But no worries. We're gonna do it. Okay. Right, let's just for 
doing it for the sake of doing it and I, again on checkpoint uh, anyways this part is really tough okay come on ouch I guess the analog uh, really didn't wanna like I was holding it that's the problem you can't you can't crouch with a d-pad on 360 control because on the emulator settings when you go to up down left right you can only select uh, it for one and I did for analog because I don't know, just feels better in general, but it will be nice to be able to crouch with the with D pad. Never mind, we're now Okay, this part is really really tough. You need to backtrack and now go up. What's here? Let's see. A pink ring, a flying one, for that matters. And another one appeared. What is gonna be up there? I I wonder. Oh, if it is in the last cage, let's destroy it. Alright. And. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. Completed. All the electors are rescued. Now we can. We can finish the phase 3 and phase. And phase. Uh, um, Space Mama. Alright. Here is the exit. And. Uh, let's see. This boss is a bit tough, in my opinion. Uh, not not that much uh, it has you need to know the pattern like for example at the beginning uh, of the boss battle you should be in the corner and wait for the washing machine to drop down and then space mama is gonna go uh, get out of the washing machine and now the fight begins lasers and shit okay uh, by the way I noticed something about Raymond's uh, sprite it's glitchy uh, Okay, you see, um, his color is a little lighter and there is something green on it when I'm standing still. Now, I can't really show you that much because I need to be moving uh, in order to dodge the attacks and stuff. But you, I think you can see it or just pause the video for that matters if you want to see it better. Okay, well, this beginning is... Okay, now this part is, this part is really fun for me. I don't know, maybe some people don't like it, but it's really actually not that hard. and It's fun for me. Uh, you just need to know where to go, depending how are these... Uh, uh, in, what in what position are these, okay? Let's see, let's see. Okay. In the middle. On the left. Now this part is gonna be, you need to run. And make sure. Okay, now run. Okay, run, 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 run. Now, ouch. Never mind. We are now safe. And yeah, the this the. Okay, now the real deal begins after this laser. Now she's gonna go behind the washing machine, and we need to destroy this, or else we can't um, harm her anymore. Basically, she is using this as a shield while firing the lasers on us. Come on. Alright, right. Actually, if you know the pattern, you jump and then immediately you press um, a crouch after the big one is there. Then you jump again. Uh, now, okay, you see, you just need a pattern. Just follow uh, the lasers carefully. Okay. And yeah, you see, it's destroyed. Now this part, okay, it's medium, I guess. You need to dodge these and then quickly run so you, she doesn't land on you and then just uh, punch her in the head. Ouch. She tricked me like she fired uh, two lasers at the same time. I honestly wasn't expecting it. Okay, two more hits and she's gone for good, okay. Uh, dodge this and jump. Okay, yes. Now, ah, not you're not gonna trick me again. And oh, this one is easy. Like for the last, you would expect something really difficult, but no. Okay, and she's gone for good. All right, Raymond wins. Now you can see the green uh, stuff on Raymond's sprite clearly. It's the emulation bug, but no emulation is perfect. Now let's see what's gonna happen. Okay, okay, look, come on. Mr. Doc, Kingdom's Batilla the Fairy.
Oh, right. Well, we see a story. Uh, the plot uh, progressed a little bit, but not that much, I guess. And we completed Space Mama's Crater. Now the rest of the game is not gonna be that hard. Now let's save this, of course. We don't wanna do this again. And that's pretty much it. Let's see. Join me in the next part where I'm gonna be playing uh, uh, Crystal Palace in the Cave of Scops. Sayonara!